This video is for Scott Cawthon, the creator of Five Nights at Freddy's. If you are not Scott Cawthon, you cannot watch this video. I'm expecting this video to have one view, one like, and one comment, and they should all be from Scott. If you are not Scott Cawthon, please leave. Scott, what the hell is this? Scott, I purchased this book because I love to read. I wanted a fun, scary Five Nights at Freddy's book. I'm just upset now. Specifically at short story number two out of three, To Be Beautiful. Scott, have you ever spoken to a woman before? Why is this the most offensively stereotypical view of women ever in this book? Why can't the main character girl want to be attractive and like makeup and like hair things? Why does that automatically make her vain? And she is vain because you you wrote her like that, Scott. Why are the other girls that are attractive and pretty also vain? Why can't people just be hot? Why do they automatically have to be bad people? Specifically, the women. Why can't women put effort into the way they look, Scott? Am I vain? I have lipstick on. Are your little robots gonna chop me up and put me in a bag? Scott, do you know how bleach works? Because I don't think you know how bleach works. I read this book. You definitely didn't do not know how bleach works. You could have watched a 20-minute Brad Mondo tutorial on how to bleach your hair, but you didn't. Scott, first of all, you don't put peroxide on your hair. You put bleach powder and developer and you mix that. That is what bleaches your hair. Not peroxide you get developer in bleach powder. Uh, when you throw that on your hair, especially when you have brown hair, it does not turn stark white as described in this book. It's gonna be yellow, uneven and upsettingly yellow. And you know what else, Scott? Let's just say somehow you did bleach your hair completely white and then you put more white on your hair. Your hair would not turn green, Scott. That is not how that works. There is nothing in either your base hair color or the hair color you just put on your head to turn it green. Maybe if it's light enough and you put some purple shampoo, maybe she'll be a little purple. She would not be green. That is not how hair works, Scott. You could have watched that Brad Mondo video, but you didn't. I know that that was really beneath you. Did her hair turn green, Scott, because she was being vain and jealous? for wanting to be attractive, for wanting to have blonde hair that makes her a bad person. Scott, I just don't understand why you felt the need to write this book the way you did. And I know you had other people help write this book with you. I don't think you even completely wrote this book. Why can't women just have hobbies, Scott? I hope you think really long and hard about this book that you wrote. And um, I hope it gets better. I really hope it gets better.